Welcome back to Good Things Utah. Alexis Hello. from Broadworks is here, and we're talking farmhouse decor. And it's the latest in decoration for it your home. It is definitely the hottest trend. It's huge it's on Pinterest. Huge. It is. It's all of it's on Pinterest. Right. It feels like. I know. Farm I feel like everything. It is. Yes. But how do you do it with if you don't have that kind of decor right. yet? Right. I do think people are worried because they may live in a condo or an apartment or a super modern house or something, and they're not not really sure how to work it in. Um, I like to mix. Like I would rather have a touch than. You don't have to change your whole house. It's kind of like a birthday party. You don't have to go with a theme. Like you can definitely scale back a little bit and just do little touches. No so overload. Just no, no, little here no. and there. You don't okay. want to have a cow or a pig in every part of your house. It's just weird. <laughs> it is Especially really weird. Especially in the bathroom, right? People are like, what is that? <laughs> What's up with her cow <laughs> yes. problem? But okay. if you love cows and pigs and you want to have maybe a small collection, that would be awesome. If, if that's the route you want to go. So, okay. So, so I see a couple of cows and pigs. Yeah. So I, I actually like the cows and the pigs together. Yes. That's cute. Yes. So that's the thing. If you're if you're gonna do the farmhouse theme, you gotta mix it up a little bit. If you do all cows, it's gonna be overload, and people are gonna be like, "What are you doing? Like this is not." They're gonna take pictures and put it on Pinterest of what not not to do. To do. Okay. Exactly. So for me, I like to start with the base stuff. So the little stuff's really cute, but that stuff can come once you get your main, you know, items. And for me, I like to spend a little bit more money on. The things that will last longer, so like, like what? a wheat wreath. Okay, I, that's it's pretty. gorgeous. Like, how could you not want this? I, regardless I of your want style, it. <laughs> and I'm, I'm going to leave with it. I didn't put anything on it. Normally, we put ribbon and, and stuff, but I think it's so fantastic, just simple and plain. Um, so I'd spend a little money on that. Uh, really nice candlesticks, a good clock. Um, a cute paddle board with chalkboard on it. Sorry, I'm going so fast. The it's fine. Can't no, but um, and I noticed you put um, chickens yes. on the yes. candlesticks. So I'm a firm believer in not putting candles on candlesticks. It, it just it's, it's too, too easy. expected. It, yeah, don't do exactly. that. Exactly, don't do something that's expected. Put so. a chicken. Put a chicken. Or I love. Of I seriously love it. No, I. And they're fat chickens. Yeah, they're so cute. Yeah. And they're and they're cement and they're very simple. So that's my thing. If you get crazy and you've got a bunch of colors and feathers and it, it's like you're on a farm. But if you don't live on a farm, which I live in a condo, so I want touches. I don't want the whole thing to be like I'm trying to be a farmer. Okay, these are some other big pieces. Like right. We're talking right. About. Exactly. So woods and metal. And so before you get all the little knickknacks, even down here, I don't know if you can see on the ground, um, these tin. Vegetable holders or whatever you want to call, them, they are fantastic. Like Those everyone are very should cool. have a pair of these. And we've got a bunch of different sizes and styles too. They, these aren't just the only two. And those um, are real carrots yeah, in there. Yeah. So I went to the grocery store this morning and got carrots That's and so potatoes. That's so creative, Alexis. Because they're so cute. But you don't always have to do vegetables because you know they're probably the potatoes are probably last, but the carrots won't. I know this from experience. Ooh, I love the texture of that. Yeah. So it, you can always um, add. Balls instead. So if you don't have vegetables or you don't want to deal with that, the any type of ball is so cute. Those Add are a little really bit of cute. Green ones, metal ones. And where do you? Where am I putting those? They can go inside here. Okay. Um, and I, I've also seen a lot of people use these for each season. So they filled it with hearts. You know, for Valentine's. Oh, that's a great and idea. Fill it with eggs. It's seasonal. You can right, just change right. it up. And all the little things that you have up here. Yep, this yep. is the all. The linens make such a big deal. So make sure you've got some really nice farmhouse linens. They're easy to find. Ours are super cute. They're not expensive. Okay, go shopping at Rodworks today. There's so many yes. locations. You need. We've got four locations here in Utah, but we also have California, Vegas, Arizona, um, Facebook, Instagram. If you aren't like, we're doing Farmhouse February. Every single day is the most fantastic stuff. Um, and we're adding things like recipes and like we're trying to get you in the groove. I love so. it. Well, and Alexis, thank you. We're going to yeah, shop at Rodworks. Yeah. Brian is has a new house. <gasps> Brian, Brian, are true. you need some pigs, some cows, and yes. some fat chickens. That's right. Get the farmer and put it all in the front porch right there. <laughs> in the front room. I love it. Now, coming up in the kitchen, let's talk about the farm. Let's talk about some food. This may look like a lollipop somewhere in there, but it's really a brownie pop.